The following tag team contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring, accompanied by Maria Sokolov, Nick Campbell, and Sanchez. Oh, the referee will undoubtedly have his hands full when these two teams collide. I'd say this team looks like they have what it takes to walk away victorious tonight. And their opponents, the World Tag Team Champions, Heath Slater and The Mastodon. Four of WWE's finest squaring off in what will assuredly be an exciting tag team encounter. And these teams have been waiting for this one, and so have I. God, there was nothing accurate about that attempt at offense. Oh, you're being too kind. Some people would use other words to describe what we just witnessed. He's absolutely relentless here. What do you think Campbell's mindset is right now? I can't say that I've ever heard Heath Slater actually... The shoulders are down! I like the pairing, Michael. These two work so well together as a team. We're looking at complete domination here. That landed perfectly. Wow, he's still down after that. If you haven't done it yet, check out WWE.com. You'll find updates and blogs from all your favorite superstars. Yeah, and don't forget to check us out on Twitter. It's at Jerry Lawler and at Michael Cole. Right, Michael Cole? Yeah, that's original. Come to think of it, I don't think I've ever seen or heard Heath Slater actually play an instrument either. Pretty odd for a guy who fancies himself as a one-man band. Of course he's a one-man band, Michael. Nobody wants to hang out with him. The guy is as annoying as it gets. And he finally gets out of the ring. He's pulling out all the stops tonight. He needs to dig way down deep if he wants to keep going now. You could call this a good old-fashioned butt whooping. Yeah, that's exactly what we're witnessing. A butt whooping. Doing a great job of avoiding any serious offense. That'll go a long way as this one progresses. That wild strike found nothing but empty air that time. <laughs> Man, that's what you call swinging for the fences and missing. Cole, what's he got in mind? Trying to build some offense. And there's the tag. Taking a lot of punishment. If it continues, it could eventually affect his vision. Yeah, already seen stars. We're looking at complete domination here. There may be no fighting out of this. Plank 
Steven Steiner. Man, oh man, that's a monster move. Nobody home there. Nobody home? Cole, that looked like the house has been empty for months. What's he gonna do here? What's he gonna do here? And there's the tag. Oh, I think this man means business. And now he's back out on the apron. He's showing no signs of letting up. Oh, this isn't good. Zigzag. Oh, man. This could be over, Cole. Here we go. This could be it. And now Sanchez got it. Sanchez with the exclamation point. Wow, now that's what you call a finisher. This might be it. Hot damn, it's exciting. The tag is made. And now Sanchez got it. Sanchez with the exclamation point. Uh-oh, there's the finisher. This what a move by Campbell. Yeah, and that should be enough, Cole. Going all the way up. Oh, that's a long way up. Incoming! Uh oh The reverse 450 splash. Man, that was vicious. Two, three. They did it! They won the match! You want to talk about crowd-pleasing? Let's go to the highlights here. And here's some highlights from the matchup. That match was incredible. Here are your winners, Nick Campbell and Sanchez. You want to talk about tag team war? We most definitely witnessed just that. This was from bell to bell, a clinic in tag team wrestling. Kudos to everyone. I love tag team matches, and that was one of the best I've seen in a while. I don't care how many wins you have. Whenever your hand is raised in victory, a certain level of excitement comes over you. And I can imagine there aren't too many people at home regretting tuning in for that amazing match. Wow.